I went on a 15-day nutrition and fitness plan and encouraged other people in my community to follow. I found pictures and statistics about animal abuse and put the text on the image and then posted them on Instagram. I volunteered at a dance class for kids with special needs for a few hours at a local organization. I volunteered at a special needs dance class and spent a few hours with my friend's special needs daughter. I made a list of 15 nutritious meals, each meal costing under $20. I raised awareness by getting friends and family to write encouraging letters to depressed children and teenagers. I volunteered and helped disabled children at an organization called Mary Mac. I also helped my disabled little sister with her medical needs. I taught an art class to elementary age students and took their art to local nursing homes. I handed out a pamphlet with cool, cheap plants in order to raise awareness about climate change. I volunteered at Mana House, a local food bank. There I fought in cardboard and I handed out food that contained necessary nutrients. I created a website and talked to third graders to create awareness for post-traumatic stress disorder. I went to a local clinic for low-income children and I shot out a lady there. I also helped organize books for the children. I rewrote a children's storybook the way a child with dyslexia would interpret it. I taught fifth graders about child poverty to spread awareness. I put up flyers in local obstacles saying where people can donate their old glasses to benefit the underprivileged. I volunteered at a local backpack program to supply food for children in need. I created a stop motion video on how much water we use, the pros and cons of water conservation, and how to conserve water and put it on YouTube. I created an Instagram account to raise awareness for wheelchair accessibility. I gave a presentation at my local masjid to spread awareness for renewable energy. I made a poster to help kids in poverty get dental care. I created a video with real life examples of animal abuse and homelessness. I posted a video on YouTube to spread awareness about Alabama's low life expectancy. I created an Instagram account. I posted three days a week to raise awareness on anxiety disorders. I created a website to bring awareness to the cruelty in the pregnant mare's yard industry. I created a schedule and advertisement for a diva day camp to benefit children with single parents. I created a movie showing the current viewpoint on hospice to help viewers change their opinion. I made a website to raise awareness about the lack of health care for children in poverty. I volunteered my time at Mana House to learn more about the impact of hunger in our community. I made a video including facts about lupus and I'm posting it all over Facebook so people in Huntsville can see it. I created a proposal for a hockey game to spread awareness about leukemia in children. I helped seniors in homebound by volunteering and assisting the people at the Castle Garden. I created multiple guidebooks on plant toxins for domestic pets and first aid tips. I created a get-together for kids on Saturday so their parents could get AA help or find a job. I presented a slideshow raising awareness for guide dogs to a fifth grade classroom. I went and volunteered at Lincoln Academy at Poverty Level School to inform people in my area about this issue. I recorded footage of the cats and dogs currently at a kill shelter in our community and then I posted the video on various social media to spread my message. I created a website to help spread awareness about the growing issue of high school dropouts in Alabama and the rest of the United States. I raised awareness about the cycle of poverty by creating a website. I made and designed an art kit that I could donate to schools who no longer have arts programs. I made a video about homelessness caused by addiction and posted it to YouTube. I made a YouTube video interviewing people in my grade about bullying. I went to Mary Mac Home to raise awareness for autism and am now doing a summer camp. I raised awareness by getting a group of friends together and volunteering at a local food bank. I raised awareness by creating a handout designed to teach children um, living in poverty um, how to make the right choices for their health. I raised awareness by making an informative website about homeless veterans. Alright, I um volunteered at an animal shelter and walked one of the animals there. I did a trial of the buddy project and showed a girl with Down syndrome what happens backstage before shows in the theater. I designed and made Alzheimer's awareness t-shirts to raise awareness for the disease. I went to Mana House, a local food bank, and helped make bags of food for the homeless. I went to Mana House, a local food bank, to help feed the homeless. I raised awareness for childhood cancer by making goodie bags and giving them to the children at St. Jude's. I created a project where someone writes a compliment about their sales every day, which boosts their confidence. Brandon and I are handing out flyers at a varsity baseball game to raise awareness for the wounded soldiers. 
I went and delivered care packages to the homeless and also volunteered at the Marin House, which is a local food bank. I created a website with an overview of vaccines and how they are essential for protection. I went to work at Bags of Blessings, a local food packing group that serves children with food insecurity, and I also encouraged others to join me in the future. I created a documentary that shows the day-to-day -day life of a child with a rare disease. I created a website about bicycle safety to show cyclists and drivers what they can do to prevent collisions. I'm having a dance camp for Merrimack participants to raise awareness for disabled children. Self raise awareness of physical bullying. I showed a video to fifth graders at Mayfair Church about what it is and how ways you can stop it. I traveled to Huntsville Animal Services to meet with Dr. Karen Shepard to learn about why there's animal abandonment in Huntsville and how to prevent it. We volunteered at Merrimack Hall, a local organization that helps children with special needs. We, we watch them be themselves and take part in something that they enjoy. I also made a video including all of my experiences at Merrimack Hall. My action plan was on special needs children in Alabama and I asked my peers and classmates how they felt on children with disabilities and how they learned in Alabama and I asked them what their, how they define disabilities. We went to a sixth grade class and taught them about autism in our community and how they can help. For my action plan, I helped out at a dog fair outside of PetSmart and started an Instagram awareness campaign at Pats for Pets. Okay, uh, we presented to third graders oh. to help educate them about the problem of animals. I went to the Huntsville NICU to deliver preemie baby clothes to parents who are struggling with extra expenses.